Hi friends, here in this video I will be explaining hinged clamp. So let's get started. Now here is the diagram of the hinged clamp. It is used in place of the latch clamp because in case of latch clamp there is provision for the latch to be swung on one or the other side. Now here the arrangement I will explain it quickly over here. This is the workpiece. Here we have the jig or the fixture body. Then these are the pivots or the fulcrum about which the respective elements would be swung. Now here there is a strap over here. So what happens is when we are loading the workpiece, in that case the workpiece is placed on the jig of fixture body and with the help of locators they are located. Then after locating we have to clamp it. So for the clamping purpose the strap is swung towards the workpiece and when it is swung towards the workpiece at the same time the hinged bolt as we can see here is brought in contact with the strap and the strap closes on the workpiece hinge bolt is attached then we have to tighten the hinge bolt and the nut which is provided over here and the workpiece gets clamped at the same time we can see over here that the stud which is provided which is provided over here it helps to adjust the height of the workpiece it means in this hinged clamp we can mount workpieces of varying height the height may change so workpieces of different heights can be adjusted over here with the help of this adjustable stud or nut given here so we can say that hinged clamp is different from the latch clamp in such a way that in case of latch clamp there was more amount of swinging action taking place of the latch and here we are having the strap and the hinge bolt which would be coming in contact for loading and unloading of the workpiece and in this way we can save a lot of production time by using the hinge clamp. At the end if you will find my videos helpful you can like share comment and subscribe our channel and share it amongst your family and friends. Thanks for watching.